guys, today I'm going to show you how you can mod Dead Island for Xbox 360 with a USB using Eclipse and Horizon. Okay, so first thing is you'll have to download Horizon and Eclipse. This is a link to Eclipse, I'll put down in the description and I'll put the link to Horizon in the description. Okay, so when you've got that, um, open up Horizon and make sure you have your USB. Um, plug your USB in. And wait for it to load. Okay, so then now that has loaded, um, as you can see there will be games, game of profiles, demos, videos, themes, game of pictures, avatar items, title updates and system items. Go to this triangle beside games and click on that and wait for that to open. As you can see it has, and if you go down, there will be Dead Island which is here. Open that. Now pick out the one that you want to mod. I'll mod this. Um, I'll mod this Logan level sixty chapter two. So right, yeah, right click on it and extract it. So just wait for that. There you go, it is now opened. Select your desktop and go to save zero and save it. Uh, just minimize horizon now. Just minimize horizon and this shouldn't appear on yours, it just appears on mine. And as you can see, C0 is here. So now open up Eclipse here and just scroll down using this when it has opened. Just scroll down until you find Dead Island. And as you can see, it is here. Click on that. And here you go, Dead Island Editor. So how to open up your Dead Island save is go to file, click on it, then hit open, and scroll up to your desktop, uh, scroll down until you find your save, as mine was save zero, as you can see it is here open that and there you go save zero character logan so max level max money you can put on experience you can put on uh, you can change the location as long as you know what they're called uh, then you can go to your inventory you can add hold firearm m9 here, melee fist, you can put max value, max level, uh, upgrade full. Uh, you can make them orange, you can mod them as what you want, and they can save. As you say, have. They can go to skills and then click um, unlock all skills, and as you can see, they're all unlocked. Then collectibles, you can just hit, click the tick on here on the top, and then click on them, and then all, then all of them will be ticked. Okay, so when you've done all of that, you won't need the settings by the way. So when you've done all that, click file, click save, click OK, click on the X. Exit out of Eclipse, go back to Horizon, 
inject new file scroll down until you find your save zero well your save as mine was called save zero don't worry about that guys as it says save zero so just go to it and as you can see it says here click open then skip this step click yes make sure your save is on your usb by the way and you or else you won't be able to do this so guys that's how you do it uh, see you in my next video bye